Vamps. <laughs> Vamp mirror. <laughs> Crazy MFB. Kill! <laughs> Is his team motto. <laughs> okay. <laughs> he's got three rerolls and 12 players. I've got an apple, he's got coach assistants and cheerleaders. So pretty, pretty fair match. He's crazy MF, is he? I thought he was crazy MB. He's a crazy motherfucker called Bice Cube. He's MFB. <laughs> New to Blood Bowl. Old oh, baby. 1-1-0. Uh, one, one, no, no audio. No. Um, okay, I'll reply to no. I'll reply to the jelly old impersonator. Is this a kill team? Slurp. I like that his motto is KILL. GFI Joe. Oh, that's a great name, isn't it? <laughs> GFI Joe. Brilliant. Blood Bowl. Blood Bowl's the stadium. Isn't that good? Feel the VIP-ness. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that was this team. <laughs> oh my god. What a great name. Who do we play against? Um, there's Vamp Mirrors. Crazy, isn't it? Vamp Mirror. GFI Joe. That is that is really good. Murloc Joe should get his name changed. That's too late now, he can't. Oh man, maybe we get a disco or a concession. How many games has he conceded? Well, only one out of six. That's uh, lower than you expect for somebody new to Blood Bowl, isn't it? Like, you know, I don't know who he is. I'm not slating him. Um. But it's like a random, you know, for a, a random record like that. Playing six games, you'd expect more concessions, I think. Wow. Team's already settled. This is day one of the new season, yeah. Yeah, only one out of six is, is below average, isn't it? Twenty out of uh twenty percent is normal. <laughs> oh Colin Guy, no, no, hey, no, no, no. Um I I was just disappointed in myself, I could have played better. Um that's all it was, wasn't it? There was no there was no shocking dice or anything, was there? It was just... I mean, I didn't enjoy getting two players killed, obviously, but... <laughs> and not winning. Because when there was a good chance to win, I thought, but... My fault at the end of the day. Didn't play well enough. That 1 in 81 was annoying as well. <laughs> I did, the 1 in 81 that, that knocked over my ball carry was really harsh, wasn't it? That was pretty unlucky. Uh, so I, maybe, I don't know, maybe I got... Maybe I got slightly worse dice, I don't know. But it didn't feel particularly bad. The dice didn't feel bad, it was just my play did. <laughs> did you sell this upon your old computer? Very good. Very good, Skuro. <laughs> Very good. Oh, blots! Oh, deep kick though, boo! Oh man, just all man's him. 
Oh, man's him. Yeah, exactly, exactly, Skuro. Yeah, I, I fucked up. I fucked up bad. That's it. Simple as that. I think it's just mostly just a bad one. At the end of the day, it's um, I would have much rather had it in this half so I could go and swarm it a bit. KO, that's pretty good. No, oh, wow, no bloodless either. Glorious. No play, no, no turn with 11 players. <laughs> Everyone's based. Well, not, not the, not the ball carrying one, but mostly everyone's based. I don't know, I don't like the kick to be honest, because I, I'm not, I'm not going to be able to hit him next turn. And then he can run around and pass it. Whereas if it had been short, you know, <laughs> if it had been, if the kick had been here, I would have had it and all vamps and everything around it or over there, I would have done, you know, blitzed him and stuff. So with a, with a, if there wasn't been a blitz, it would have been a decent kick because then it would have been like, you know, um, he would have probably got his team split. Whereas now. With basing everybody. <laughs> I kind of want to score as soon as possible. So I'd rather have a short kick and have the ball in my hand. But, oh yeah, he's going to just 2D down the line now. Yeah, we can just use his reroll on the bloodlust though, can't we? So it's only 1 in 36 that he can't try to pick it up. I think it's pretty overblown the uh, the effect of bloodlust to be honest. Like obviously sometimes it's horrible when you cast your own guys, sure, but you don't have to like position it about it around it that much. I don't think. It's just my opinion. We're gonna lose a hypnotic gaze marker now. Wow, the ball in Karaku. I guess you just try, don't you? You play another one and see what happens. I guess. Seems like a good idea. Might as well play a second and see what happens. Oh, he's, uh, he's cast. See, that's what I mean. Like, the, the effect of it can be horrible when, when you're bloodlust. But I think the positional aspect of it is overblown. Yeah, if you eat one of my flowers, that'd be good. Wouldn't it? Oh, he's failed to pick up. And he uses a reroll. Oh, I can just pick that up. I can just pick it up then, gaze him. <laughs> That's pretty funny. 
blitz him. Oh, I could gaze him. I don't want to hit anybody. I don't want to activate vamps if I don't have to. He could stand up, then he could punch him, then he could punch him, then he could go and stand there. Then he could blitz him. Blitz him, double GFI, pick up the ball, gaze. That's funny, isn't it? I just really don't want to activate my fucking vamps. One, two, three, four, five, six. Gaze him. Then block him. And he's still not freed up. Can't free up this guy now. How can a vampire be gazed? Yeah, it's a good question, isn't it? It's a bit daft. No, fuck it, let's get him going. No dodge to be made here, because he's, he's gazed. Come on. Oh shit, I've got to re-roll the, the GFI. I, w I, wouldn't, I wouldn't have re-rolled the pickup, um, but I had to re-roll the GFI, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, done, yeah, I will try if I can. He's in a bit of a pickle. The only thing is I've I have zero thrall support for these three vamps. <laughs> I really need a fucking touchdown next turn. Just cause getting all of you guys punched every turn isn't good. I mean even though I've outbashed him <laughs> by herb derping him. <laughs> well, it wasn't really there was that bluff. One punch and then a, a thrall, a vampire bite. Oh, he's going to bite again now. I mean, it, to be fair, vampires using a hypnotic gaze on another vampire is a bit stupid, but it's nowhere near as stupid as Nurgle warriors being disgusted by other Nurgle warriors and not blocking them. I think that's the, the, the worst thing. At least I can win the middle now anyway, because he's pulled so much back here. At least I can win the fight in the middle again now. Oh, he's rolled a one! He's rolled a one! He's down a one re-roll on turn two! Ah, oh, he gets the pal. Dirty boy. Dirty boy. Feeling the VIP ness.
Is he going to pass it or what? This doesn't look very safe, does it? <laughs> <laughs> very good school very good alright he can go in there to assist this block to free up this thrall which is good because then he can go there and then use him if something goes tits up these guys can go there to punch a vampire alright punchy punchy get a push good enough Right, dodge and then dodge blitz is 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 as simple as it gets, isn't it? with only one reroll. Maybe I should have been. I don't know. Maybe I should have rerolled the bloodlust. I don't know. Fuck it. I don't want to use the rerolls the names I should. It was getting a <laughs> it was getting a vampire knocked out. <laughs> Maybe I should have rerolled it. Maybe I should have moved him first. So that if he bloodlusted he could have done that easily. Maybe should have moved him first. Maybe he should have gone there and gazed him. And then I could have moved him first. I don't know what I should have done. Probably not that. <laughs> I guess it's safe to say. Not not lose a vamp for the drive. Probably wasn't the best play. Maybe she just stood him up. Got a double down on the basing, everybody, haven't I? With uh... <laughs> yes, unreal. I want to get down to the optimal number of vans, which, as we all know, is two. <laughs> oh god. Oh, fat for Gazi. Uh, good enough, thanks. Fails the gaze. Oh, one nice pow. Fuck off. Well, there's the roll I failed by fucking losing my vampire. Brilliant. Now what the fuck do I do? One dice on the ball. Get in. If I fail that, then I'm fucked anyway. Oh, I really went too far forward with him, didn't I? 
I guess. Roll a one. Ah! Fuck! That would be terrible as uncle. I think it's fucking terrible. I can't believe that actually happens. Holy shit. He's out of rerolls though, and it's turn four. I would have been out of rerolls if, <laughs> if I'd still had that vampire. <laughs> Yeah, that was a real bad thing. See, the deep kick was shit because I meant that I fucking overextended his vampire. That is absurd, yeah. I, I, I can't even believe it happens. Like, it's ridiculous, isn't it? It's ridiculous that it's ever happened once. Holy shit. Basing everyone's good, isn't it? Because he, he can fail any single roll, so it's good that everybody's based. So he's still not in a great spot with his zero re-rolls. But I'm just pissed off that I'm the one failing everything. <laughs> hey, well, there you go. Say that, and then he does fail something. Good. All right, brilliant. But what can I do about it? One... Right. Can block him. <laughs> and my reroll's gone. Because I can't just lose a turn, can I? Fuck's sake. him <laughs> no. no I've lost two of them because I can't stand him up because if I roll a one I just he just gets turned over it's fucking horrible <sighs> the blitz was so good but I guess I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have made that fucking double GFI pickup attempt that cost me a re-roll and Cost me a vampire for the drive, ultimately. I shouldn't have done it. I should have just kept him. Like it was fu I liked how funny it was to, to, you know, do it and then stand next to him and uh, stand next... To oh, that's good. The fail means he's got to go backwards or at least across. Oh. Yeah, screw up. But there's been shitheads and there's been absolutely fucking crazy, insane shitheads. Like, swatting is so bad. It's 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 literally unbelievable, isn't it? I can't even believe it's a real thing. Oh man, he's just gone for a four plus without a reroll. I can't even believe it's a thing. Like, it's insane. Hey, thanks, buddy. <laughs> oh, well, uh, that was all right, wasn't it? No, oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should have gone and just tried to gaze him because I couldn't. I couldn't have, uh, like, failed the gaze, could I? It wouldn't have been a turnover. Don't really know what I'm doing here. Kind of want to block him, but...
go there and stand him up and block it, but then he can't go anywhere. What are you doing? There. What are you doing here? And what are you him. doing? Ah. That's not very good. Stand there. And then he can go here. Finally get stood up. Dickhead van. And uh Yeah, okay. He can go there to base him. Herb dirt, base, base, base. Glorious. And just let him roll dice. <laughs> yep, he made a four plus without a rerun got fucked. That is literally exactly what happened. Tactical games with less RNG, yes, or else. <laughs> oh god. And this is good, even though the two pluses are still just rolls you can make and fail, aren't they? Hasn't failed these two. Oh, and he can he can gaze and then just and then it's a two dice. Oh shit. He didn't gaze. See that was much worse. His his not gazing was much worse than my not gazing. Right. So Wanna put him to there? And he wants to try and gaze because a gaze can't be a turnover. Whereas normally I would have liked to have blitzed him. Um It's another roll that could fail, isn't it? Him anyway, because I'm trying to get star player points. <laughs> what an absolute fuckhead. What an absolute dickhead I am. <laughs> yeah, it is auto look. Fucking fail. Oh, and he got it and still didn't catch it. Oh, fuck off. Is it sunny? Oh, fuck, it was sunny. Alright, well, it was pretty stupid with it being sunny. I didn't know it was sunny. Um, <laughs> in my defence, I didn't know it was sunny when I went for that pass. But, um, that was he was on five and he was on three, so it was pretty greedy to go for the pass there. I wouldn't have done it if I known it was a three plus. Did he waste his reroll on a 5 plus case? Did he? I didn't even know that. Wow, I didn't really know that. I didn't know that's what he'd done. But, um. Yeah, maybe he didn't. But he should have tried that, shouldn't he? For sure he should have tried there to get to get two dice on the ball. I should have punched him maybe to get the other guy down. He would have been there. Screening everything off. Hey, he's been pretty unlucky on the on the bloodlust rolls, but then he hasn't had any rerolls, has he? You rivers have, so like, I feel things, he's feel things. It is what it is. Bloodlust, he's off. Right, so the three star player point guy can get the ball. Um, that's better, isn't it? No 
now, but he killed. Can only base the ball. KO. But maybe I don't need him back as a in case to score. That's probably a good idea, isn't it? And I was gonna go and fucking assist this blitz. Oh shit. Oh. Hey. <laughs> yeah, exactly, I don't, yeah. Oh, was he not stunned? Could I have just stood him up? That was pretty bad if I could have just stood him up. So then he could have stood there. And then I could have stood there. And then I could have blitzed him. And then everything would have been good. But instead I fucked it right up. This would be great. This if I get a score on turn 8, won't it? I should have checked. I thought I was going for a farming pass. <laughs> but yeah, it should be easier. Like It's obvious when it's a blizzard or raining, isn't it? No, I'm not. I've got a throw. I'm fucked if I like have to do a 1 in 9 or something and, and fail it. He's not even blitzing with it with this. So yeah, no, no problem. All I'm gonna do is fucking score. Yeah, that was the thing. Maybe not though. Maybe not actually have to roll dice because it would have been like a gaze and stuff, but um, it, not failure state dice. Good guy. Feel the vip -ness. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, Wolfpack. Yeah, I thought he should have tried to force dice, I, I agree. You know, two out of three back. But he's down to ten now, isn't he? Three, six, ten. And I've still got eleven. Oh, yeah. An actual level. Five SPP vampire can carry it. And then hopefully pass to three SPP vampire to score and level three vampires in one game. That would be the absolute fucking dream. I was wondering on his drive though, but yeah, yeah, it's 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 not as good as it would normally be. Yeah. I really don't have to use a rear on the fucking punches. Don't use a rear on anything this turn. Do I? If I fail, I fail. I can only base the ball. Hello, Matto, it is indeed. I am indeed.
Fuck. <laughs> I was doing that so that I'd complete the screen so I could move a, that, that the thrall that I'm biting could have been moved back to, to get the ball. Now it's got to be this one. Vampire Blitz, oh, fucking cunt. Maybe I shouldn't have blitzed. I thought maybe it wasn't worth it. Well, I punched a guy. I punched a guy, but what did it cost? Let's find out. Probably wasn't activate, worth activating, stupid. Deserves a cars. Lucky me. Stun two of mine. <laughs> I came worse. I came off worse than him from that turn. <laughs> I'll bash myself. Oh dear. It's good that they faced off each against each other, so that you know. It's it's fully. I mean, it would be deserved anyway, but it's it's fully deserved, isn't it? Elliot's record is absolutely was absolutely insane, wasn't it? It was absolutely insane record. Fucking half. Yeah, the best, uh, the best vamp ever. Well, the best player ever on Fumble, actually. The the most star player points player ever on Fumble has movement seven, strength six, agility five, vampire blodge. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. Punch. This sucks, doesn't it? Let's go, vampire! Oh, shit. Can we throw a... No, no, it's Debog. Debog is the most star, star player points ever on Fumble. And he is... Uh, he has 7-6. Seven, 7-6-5-8 six. Seven, six, Blodge. Good old Debog. Oh, that's ranked. Uh, the problem with ranked is ranked is not real. It's a complete pretend thing. Um, so, you know, ranked is about as realistic as just making it yourself. Sage had a 3000 TV Wood Elf team in ranked. So that tells you all you need to know about ranked, doesn't it? You know, so you can't really you can't really count out him. 
It's still the bog anyway. The bog still beats him. So there you go. The bog beats that guy anyway. He's not even good. 12, 8, 7. 12, 8, 7. A thrower is not top rank. No, it's it, it's the bog. It's the bog. The um he has got the best scorer with four eight seven touchdowns. He is the brightest star with twenty fifteen SPPs. He's the oldest player with six hundred and forty three games, and he's the best rusher with eight thousand seven hundred and four yards. So, yeah, it's the bog is 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 the one. There you go. Hello, necro impotence. Yeah, a, 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 a fucking a vampire mirror is is something else, isn't it? Um, I really don't have to activate the fucking vampires. That's the problem. One, two, three, four, uh, one, two, three, four, five. See, I could go like a blitz with this and then come back, I guess. He wants to go there and gaze. Oh, he go there and gaze. I just don't have to activate. <laughs> Got away with it. Right, he can stand up. He can go there. He can go there. You can blots. You can get bitten now. <laughs> no, it doesn't have to be. Yeah. And he still doesn't have to be bitten. Good for him. Well done, Thrall. You didn't get bit. Keeps the no, he doesn't keep the I was gonna say it doesn't matter now. Let's gaze him. It's great, isn't it? The, the gaze is pretty good. Someone bribed me, Matt. Oh, somebody bribed me. Somebody bribed me. Heavily bribed to play vampires. I mean, it's okay. It's all blood ball, isn't it? Lads? It's, it's, it's not particularly worse than playing any other race. <laughs> I should be trying to articulate more, though, shouldn't I, what I'm thinking? But it's, it's tough. It's tough, I like and I did when I started streaming, but then I've I've devolved as I've gone on. I'm just trying to just grind him out because I've I don't wanna fucking expose my balls, do I? That's the thing. So if he if I can just get away with activating less vamps than him. I've got a man advantage if I can keep that. It should be alright, shouldn't it? No, I still expect to win every game, Will King. <laughs> I can't stop that. But I mean I know that I can't. I know that anyway, Will with any team. Obviously you can't win every game, can you? But It still, it still doesn't stop me expecting. Well, not expecting to. I don't expect to win. I think that's a bit. Yeah, it's a bit prickish. I wouldn't say I expect to win every game, but um, I expect to have a good chance every game, and I expect to have less of a chance with vampires. So there's some, there's some truth to it somewhere along the line. Yeah. I can bite the guy in the corner. Right, I don't have to. Good lad. Oh, you can't 
I should have blitzed. Make him roll dice. <laughs> That's all I can do. Make him activate vamps. Well, I'm not activating mine if I can help it. Thanks, Dr. Horobosco. No, I mean, I don't expect to win every game, you know. Obviously, look, if you if you get drawn 300 TV down, you don't expect to win it, do you? Um, I don't. I expect to have, I don't know, X amount of chance of winning every game. I think I'm pretty... I think I'm pretty realistic in my expectations and assessments of things. I wouldn't say... Ex I mean, yeah, I wouldn't say expect to win. I just think if I play well, I'll win. <laughs> if I play well, I should win. <laughs> and that's not the... You don't even get that in Fumble. I have Fumble in Blood Bowl, do you? You don't even get that in Blood Bowl. If you play well, you should win. doesn't even happen. Like, you should. But you know, you know that you can play well and not win. So... No, you don't expect an incredible record like Woody's. No, that's true. You obviously expect to do worse with vampires than you do with with woodies and you expect to do worse with pro elves than you do with woodies and stuff but you know it's still in each, in each individual game you don't expect that you'll get fucked by the dice even though it happens doesn't it <laughs> Right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look for a reasonable goal for myself. <laughs> um, okay, let's go. Let's go this. This is, this is too good. How do people do this well with vampires? This is this is. I don't think I'll do even. I don't even think I'll do this well. But let's do it. Sixty nine. Oh god. <laughs> is behind the times. Oh, that's rough. That's about the best I'm going to hope for, to be honest, with Vamps. <laughs> oh, shit. Might not be good enough. Oh, he played 40. Yeah, 16 plus 30, 26. He played 42. No goal grits. Oh, God. And he did better win percentage than I think I'll get. Oh, God. Not good. Is he gonna foul? Plus one assist. Seems seem, seems a bit fucking rowdy, you know. Oh right, we can fuck off over here. Hmm. Where, where are my vampires? Oh, he's stunned. I really don't want to have to bite anybody. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Let's bite that guy if I have to. If not, I'll go there. Good. Shit. 
yeah, getting the right opponents does help for sure, yeah. Yeah. 2466 is average. That's pretty good. I mean, that's really good, isn't it? It's vampires. Elves are the weakness for sure, Wolfpack, yeah. Obviously. I mean, it's obvious, isn't it? Vampires. Vampires' biggest strength is breaking cages, and elves don't need to cage. So. Oh, you rerolled the Bloodlust. What a madass. Maybe I should re-roll that. There's only three turns left after that. Maybe I should re-roll that roll down. Because it would have made maybe getting these vampires in the way. Wow, one dice blitz. Get up there. I'm going to be reduced down the blitz with a ball carrier here. And <laughs> no, I'm going to want an 81. <laughs> <laughs> They're just better at being elves. Breaking up, but elf screens aren't even very good anyway, so, you know. Oh. Maybe there's a way out here, eh? Need to. I <laughs> need to not fail though. Two players over here, it's good, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five. He just hasn't recovered his guy. a dodgy or whatever happens. So maybe I don't blitz with him. I think I've done goofed somehow. Right, he can stand up whatever happens. Got a blitz, haven't I? So he could stand up, then he could blitz dodge. Or he could dodge blitz. Or he could blitz and then he could just stand up. And he could just block. I don't like blitzing, one in nining and then not having a reroll for the dodge. So I think I'm just going to go for the straight up dodge. I 
fights with him is best. Does it? Yeah, it matters, doesn't it? Yeah, it does matter. Nice. It doesn't. It doesn't matter because it's an easy one dice on the ball. <laughs> so yeah, it did matter. I <laughs> build all my vamps as pommers. <laughs> Very good. Oh god, this is rough only having only having uh, <laughs> one reroll for two turns after that big fail there. All the vampires are in good spots, but the thralls aren't, are they? The thralls are off on one side. High roller six 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 Benson and Hedges. He's rolled the one. He's rerolled it again. He likes rerolls, doesn't he? I mean, rerolled a couple of bloodlusts. But for all that I've been trying to conserve my rerolls and trying to get him to use his, <laughs> he's still he's still got one. We've both got one each, and that. I feel like I've been eating eating things that I didn't want to eat to conserve rerolls. And I feel like he's been frivolous with them. Yet he's still got them and I don't. I just fucking dodge here, don't I? I just fucking dodge. He could block one, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. Block him, then blitz with him. Get cover, dodge with him at the end. Start with an 11 block first. Good. Oh, this guy punching him. I could punch him. Then I could and get a push, then I could blitz him to get him away. And try and do this block first. Oh pretty shit. You could try and gaze him. Fuck, because then I was gonna give a two plus out there. So just blitz with him? I then would rather block there first. So one, two, three, four, five, six. GFI. GFI. Oh god. Seems pretty shitty. Welcome to Shitty Walk. It's a power, you can go there, and then he can push into there, and then get the fuck out. Yeah, I've got to do it, haven't I? Oh. 
and really wanted to power. Because actually he could have blitzed there and that would have been way better. I could have powered him to there and then he could have blitzed and been away of the cover. Now the vampire's got to blitz himself. And then he gets a push. Useless cunt. He's only got one... No, he's got two turns left. Oh, fuck. You can surf me as well. I might as well cheer if I can actually do it anyway. One, two, three, four. Oh god, I can't make a dodge in case it fails. This one I guess I can. And that, that makes things a bit harder. Weeks he's out. Potato, full potato though. Glorious. Glorious vampire potato. Would have been nice if like anything had worked on that turn. No, no, I wouldn't wasn't the first game of this team, Mr. Lawrence. Trolls and orc teams in CCO. Just be <laughs> good, good Ernick. Um, I don't know. It's funny because you, you're going to end up... On the one hand, if you don't have the troll, you're less likely to meet a big bloaty claw team. But on the other hand, if you've got a troll, it's a bit more strength against and regen against the big bloaty core team. So I think I'd have them in the leagues probably just for the extra strength. I used his reroll. So this is this is a good pro tips what not to do with vampires. He's used all three rerolls on bloodlusts, which were pretty irrelevant. Oh, I, I'm I'm not allowed to talk about them. Zokazai. Yeah, I think the troll's good because it? it gives you more strength. The only thing is, it gives it's better against Bash because you've got more strength on the pitch, isn't it? But against Elves, you've got an unreliable slow player, which is a bit shit. So I think you're a bit stronger against Elves without a troll, and I think, but I think you're a bit work, a bit better against Bash with a troll. But then the thing is, you obviously you, you you're more likely to get matched up against a horrible Bash team if you've got the troll. So. Yeah, exactly. There you go, Wolfbark. I don't know if you can get out strength by Bash. There's nothing that really outstrengths Orcs. Well, Nurgle. But Orc strength is like outstrengthing and Did he just did he just block anyway after failing Bloodlust? Yeah he did. <laughs> yeah, he's obviously he must be new. New to vampires because that was that was not the play. You can change to a movement action to go to bite and he just carried on with his block. Right, GFI. I can't get a thrall in, in there. Is he in scoring range? Yep. Yeah, if he chains him, I guess he's not gonna chain him. So I guess I don't bother I just do the GFI. Good luck. Oh yeah. Feel the VI penis.
shame that I didn't level them both way. But still. Two. A two point guy can be protected. Uh, he's probably not going to score a one turner, but let's still stop him. Um, yeah, if you have a thrall adjacent to the end zone, and if you have any of these squares, you can score and then bite the thrall, but you've got to bite before you score. You have to, you have to bite before you score. So if you don't, if you can't bite, you don't score. Um, yeah, plus, yeah, gobble and, troll and gobble for one turn is alright, isn't it? Um... You can score with Bloodlust, you've just got to bite first. That's it. So you can be affected by Bloodlust and score, but you've still got to bite. If you don't bite, you don't score. Thanks, Zokazai. <laughs> that was a... Uh... It's, it's, it's annoying just because it, everything can fall apart so easily because you've got no fucking block and no fucking dodge. And it's just horrible, isn't it? But now I'm going to have A block and A dodge. Eighty K. I'm not going to get better than four. <laughs> Slurb, he made 12 EV breaks, I made eight. But how many of those were with blocks? <laughs> not many, I tell you. Um... I, I made four AV breaks with Bloodlust. 90% Bloodlust. And he re-rolled some of his. So he maybe made like four as well. Probably we did four AV breaks on ourselves. <laughs> it's fucking daft that that, that includes the, uh, the thing. Oh yeah, double six and double and six plus five, yeah. I'd be, I'd be happy with that, to be fair. Right, let's see. Buy cakes. Gets, lock or dodge, and knight for go gets. Oh, block or dodge. <laughs> Question is which one? I guess eight, give eight, give the one on eight blocks so that he can make the punches every turn. And keep, keep a move busted throw, I guess, so he can go on the LOS, can't he? It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I want more players and then I can get the 4 3 roll as soon as possible. Um, so, yeah, I reckon block and dodge. Let's do that. Block and dodge. SPPs, as I like to do. Even though he's move busted. Yeah, he can, he can be on the LOS and just get fucking eaten by people, can't he? <laughs> Passes the double. <laughs> Glorious! 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 Thank you very much. Not that relevant. Welcome to Team Fantastic. And on that bombshell, let's end the stream. Not end the stream, end the YouTube video. End the YouTube video. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic. Glorious! Thank you very much, guys. <laughs>